We're here with Coach Tomich after a 3 0 sweep over the IUPUI Jaguars. Coach, can you give us your thoughts? Um, it, it, it's, it wasn't our best performance this season. I think we played enough to win. Uh, there were some positives. I thought our backcourt defense played well, uh, again, led by uh, Kali Saimet and uh, uh, Taylor and Paulina also did their job, uh, double digit digs. Uh, offensively, Maddie Brandery was um, consistent again today. She had another very good match, very efficient match, so that was good. Um, I also thought Isabel Marciniak um, did a nice job uh, defensively, and I, I loved how alert she was on the net. Actually, she got some nice uh, kills off of uh, overpasses. So, overall, uh, it was an okay performance. Uh, I, I thought we served really well. I thought we kept IUPUI out of system a lot. Uh, I don't know what uh, aces, yeah, we ha uh, had five aces, but they were most of the time out of system, so I was very pleased with, uh, with our serving game. A uh, strong performance in the BJSU Invitational so far, two wins, uh, one game left tomorrow. What's the mentality of the team going into MAC play next weekend? Yeah, well, we have one more tomorrow. We play Nickel State, so we are not overlooking anybody. Uh, we hope we uh, you know, win tomorrow and uh, win our home tournament. Um, it's, uh, it would be a nice uh, way to start the MAC with a, a four-match winning streak. So I think four or five, I don't even know. Five, I think. Um, but uh, we have Nickel State tomorrow, and uh, we'll be ready for, for them. Uh, and then we'll think about Buffalo, that we open, uh, with whom we open the MAC. And like you said, with the uh, medal of bravery, uh, with 11 kills, how is she able to have uh, such a nice game? Uh, she's very disciplined. She made herself available to, to Isabel, to our setter. Um, she made very, very smart choices. I think she made her first hitting error in, uh, in the third set, but uh, when she couldn't be aggressive, she plays the ball really well, and uh, that's something we've been working on as a team, our efficiency, and uh, Maddie has improved tremendously in the last couple of weeks. Yeah, and uh, like you said with uh, Nickel State, uh, what are you looking for from them? Um, well, they've had a different lineups uh, in every match, so we really don't know what lineup they're going to have against us. But I think that's less important uh, than what we're going to do on our side of the net. Um, uh, I, um, we, we still need to improve in some things. I think our efficiency today, hitting-wise, wasn't as, as good across the board. Uh, so that's something we're going to look for and continue our strong serving and serve receiving game. Um, I think that's going to be the key tomorrow and just um, improve our, our hitting efficiency. And uh, also with the aggressive uh, style of play, uh, do you feel like you were able to uh, do that from the uh, beginning of the match or is that something else you feel like you want to work on? Uh, can you please repeat that? Oh, oh yeah, with the aggressive uh, style of play that you were uh, yeah, talking about earlier. Um, uh, and do you, do you feel like you would... Yeah, do you feel like you started that from uh, the uh, beginning of the match? Um, we were kind of inconsistent. I didn't like our energy on the court in the first set. We talked about it. We kind of we were flat. And uh, we, we just told the team to communicate, start communicating, over-communicating more on the court and, and uh, just getting more physical contact, high fives, eye contact to build the energy of our side on, on the, of the net. Um, I think last night's match took a, a lot out of us emotionally, kind of, but we have to learn how to do that, and, and I hope we get a little bit more energy tomorrow from the beginning till the end.